Now, what can we do to help go to sleep? This is some things that we see a lot of people today with using social media and technology. And that's one of the worst things we can do is staring at our computers or phones or bright lights right before bed because it stimulates our brain. It's almost like having caffeine to where your brain is constantly on the go. You got to turn the brain off because if you don't turn the brain off, then it's hard for it to relax and rest. And it's even more difficult for you to go to sleep. So try to avoid TV, technology, social media, computers, anything that's going to keep your brain active. The room should also be dark and cold. Typically under 70 degrees, 68 degrees is recommended. Uh, this I spoke at a conference with a um, sleep expert, and this is what Dr. Mehta Singh has recommended as regards to a good good uh, temperature for a room for your body to start relaxing. Also take a warm shower before bed to help the muscles relax. You can do things like meditate or read a book, relaxation, breathing, try to avoid late workouts if you can. Uh, sometimes that's impossible for athletes, so we know. And as we talked about is avoid caffeine three to four hours before bed.